Punch Carl is going to um, run us through. Um, and then we're going to go through 12 dynamic drills related to the positions on the court. So they're really fun. Let's go, Cal. All right, so let's start with some um, pitter padding press. So just get your legs moving, get your arms moving, get that heart rate up. All right, let's go side to side. Little dodges. Give us a thumbs up, make sure you can hear us. <laughs> so Carly's going to be the passer in this one. So this first drill is all about our wing attack, getting depth on our second phase. So we're going to set up our cones in a triangle. So one cone at the top and two at the back here. I'm going to start in the middle. I'm going to drive up to the first cone. And then I'm going to make a second phase drive back to um, one of the back cones so I can choose. And Carly's going to release the ball into that back space. So my prelim move is driving forward and I get the ball on back space. Okay? Sue's going to chuck the clock on for a minute. The clock for a minute. And I'm going to work hard for a minute. So Holly will give a minute. demo first. Yep. So driving up. forward and then back. And then taking the ball in the back space. Alright. Alright. Alright, clock's on. And ready? A minute starts now. Shoulders and hips facing the ball. 
strengthen to please back. Awesome. Last one. One, two, three, four, through the front and clear to back. Awesome. Good job. All right, our next one. So we've covered off our wing attack and our center moves. Now we're going to go into the goal attack, hold and pop. So you just need one cone for this. Carly's got that in the middle there. Just through that through one. So her cone is her defender. She's going to do a front seal or a back seal. It doesn't matter. We'll mix it up for the whole minute. She gets a really strong stance. And as soon as I put the ball in, she's going to pop open her wide stance and reach out for the ball in the lunge position. And it can be forward or back space. All right, if you don't have a ball or passer, you will still do the same motion. You just won't receive a pass. All right, let's go. Clock on, Sue. And pop. Seal the defender and pop. Seal the defender and pop. Seal and reach. Good. Seal and pop. And see how Carly's doing a really good split when she catches it? So she's really getting her shoulders in front and away from her defender. So great for our goal attack goal shooters in the ring. When they're on a nice clean feed. Seal and pop. Seal and pop. Yep, seal and pop. Good lunging. This one's really good for Carly too, coming back from an ACL injury. She's putting like a weight on those knees of hers. And having two kids. Alright, finish it off. Last one. Alright, really good. So we've covered our wing attack, we've covered our centre, we've covered our goal attack. The next one we're going to do is our goalkeeper. So think Sharni Layton style. She's playing against a really tall goal shooter and she wants to just dictate and deny the goal shooter from getting a really clean feed. So this will be more um, like she's swooping the goal shooter. She's putting doubt in the feeder's mind. That's what this one is. Carly's going to chuck in a random surprise. I'm the goalkeeper that's going to intercept it off my tall goal shooter. Yep. So that was help. My goal shooter's the cone. And I'm just going to be really dictating them, going around them, denying their space. Carly's going to chuck in surprises. And I'm the goalkeeper that's going to intercept that ball. Yeah. All right, clock on. And let's go. So goalkeepers get really creative in this one. So we're denying. We're making the feeders look stupid because we don't want them to feed a good pass with him. <laughs> so working around my phone.
I'm so unfair. <laughs> So cones in a four, in a square, doesn't matter if they're off center a bit, that still works in this drill. So this one's called the ball hog. The player that gets every second pass, every pass, they're energetic, and sometimes they're too energetic and they need to stop. So we're gonna work hard for one minute in the space of that square. You can go to any cone, you can do roll off, double dodge, any little skill you want out of your bag of tricks, and Carly's going to feed the ball in. Yep, your throw is just going to pop the ball in every time. So every couple of seconds, I'm going to be throwing the ball into Holly um, so she can take the ball. You can do this with the ball hog. Yes. So they chase that ball everywhere. All right, let's go. Clock side, Mum. Here, working. Get her hands up. 
Let's go. Working round, working round, and go. Arms go up. Good. Working hard, working, working, go. Awesome. Working, working around, and big tall stance. Good. Go. Oh, I'm losing my words. That's it. Making sure we've got our eyes up the whole time. We want to be looking up. Really good. Checking out your feet. And this is good really for any player, not just our wing defensive goalkeepers. Every player is a defender out there. Good, arms up. <laughs> and back. Really good. How long, Sue? 15 seconds. Outside arm, outside arm. And hands up. Good.
Then all she does is use a really good change of speed. So Kylie's going to be our Laura Langman mod. She's going to be running down the court, her full power, and all she's going to do is stop and pop back. And if you watch videos of Laura Langman, this is all she does. Her timing is impeccable, and she uses her change of speed and the right side of the channel of the ball inside, in the side of the play to gain possession. It's that simple. So Carly running down the court, and turn and pop. And she's got, the, she's got her defender on the outside. It's really simple. All right, let's go. Here to go to turn and pop back. Running, 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 turn and pop back. Good. Running and turn and pop back. Running, 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 turn and pop back. All right, let's go. Three more, sis. Running, turn and pop. <laughs> Make sure you're alternating both sides. Yeah, using both sides of the court. and highlights real of Laura Langman. Um, that is just a key to her game. All right, our last one we're going to do is our goal defence box out. Or so goalkeeper goal defence box out. So Carly's going to pretend to be the goal shooter. I'm going to have hands over and she's going to pretend to shoot. We won't do it because I'll probably get bonged in the head. And all I'm going to do is she's released her shot. I'm turning and blocking and I'm jumping up for that rebound. And this is a really close gap yeah, here. Yeah. All right, so great one for our defenders. So let's put the clock on for a minute. Hands up, good defensive stance, the goal shooters release the ball, and we're turning the blocking. All right? And alternate if you're going to jump or um, you to alternate your defensive stuff. So you might defend one hand, one side. You might do two hands straight over. Yeah. You might do a bit of a lean on one leg. Yeah. But the main um, thing is to turn and box out. Yeah, you've got to be quick. Quick, clock's on, let's go. Sorry. And two hands, go. and in. I'm jumping up for that rebound. I'll do the lean. Three, two, three, two and a block. Okay. Two hands, two, three, up. I was never a defender for my time. One and two, and up. Yeah. 